Hello everyone, this is Danish from jobskillshare.org. Today I would like to talk about two important and common questions we get in our platforms through email, phones and chat. The first one is interview in few days. Um, this is basically mostly coming from non-members, uh, mostly coming from non-members or maybe even a members who um, haven't finished most of our courses. So usually on Google, on YouTube, we have videos where we teach real world skills and a lot of people look into those type of videos and of course they're very close to the job descriptions that we basically make our trainings on so usually a job descriptions are like you go to the help desk positions for level one level two or any other support positions uh, you usually look at the descriptions and that's where um, most of the new members or who are new to our platform uh, they get a little confused because, you know, descriptions are a little bit of everything and they would put a lot of years in there, different type of skills in there. So there's a concept behind it. There's a way to tackle that. We have a full uh, YouTube playlist on that, on how to actually understand this description and what is actually going on in this career. So then you can tackle this type of wordings or descriptions or requirements in a better way. So for that, you have to take a program, right? You have to understand everything uh, in a very specific uh, and detailed manner. But since you don't have that kind of time, which this is the first uh, group of people that I'm talking to right now, I'm going to like as a first person now, interview in a few days is basically, I don't have the ability to tell you to, okay, yeah, you have to go back to our program. You have to start our program and our program is going to take you two or let's say four months because you're brand new to IT it may take you more to understand and how to do this program and everything like that so of course that's not a good answer so the answer for anyone who is actually in this scenario where you are trying to get ready for the job without actually going for a full-blown program what can we do to help you so this help is basically like a it's not even a quick fix it's kind of like a try which is definitely gonna help you but of course we been in this profession for many many years no one can claim that even if I give you five days training that still doesn't make you an IT professional when people call someone an IT professional it's it's a it's a lot to it basically there's a lot of skills backing that person to be called an IT professional it's just, a, it's just the way it works because you, you need to work on different type of scenarios, products, projects, environments, you know, working with different type of people. And that's the whole experience just gives you that type of skills, which can be only then achieved in a program as real as what we provide basically with labs, community, uh, different type of trainings that you won't see in theories or even in certifications. Uh, so it's a lot of a lot of things that are involved. So that's the, that's the first concept that you really need to understand um, if you have not taken our program. So how can you get ready now? Like you know, you you just don't have any other option right now because it's a few days. So we do have a a course that can get you ready for interview, specifically for interview. And even that course, you need to spend some time on it. So. Of course, if your interview is in six hours, then you probably will just need to go over that course very quickly. But if you have a few more days, then I think you can make it. So how do you take this program? How do you take this course? Two ways. One, you need to be on jobskillshare.org, registered. When you click on login, registered, registration is free. Once you registered in this description, when you log in, in this description of this video, you can after logging into our platform you can actually open the course which is basically this one right here i'm going to open this which is basically a last part of our courses in this uh in this platform um, and you can see why it's last because we want people to understand everything before they go and apply for jobs so the people who actually are part of this platform i'm kind of like jumping into this one right now the people who are part of this platform, we tell them that you finish the IT fundamental course first, you finish the second course second, 
and the third one which is a ticketing system then you start applying for jobs and we actually tell people that even in the first course when you finish the first course we call this a lucky twice like you just get that resume where we think it's pretty good because most of the interns that have worked with us in our communities most of them have used this resume some have changed it and most of the members actually used it and a lot of people got jobs right and there's a different concept in this in this area where we, when we say start the program and start applying they get the job right so I will come back to this a little bit later on in this same video but I want to jump straight to why is the resume after so many courses because you know it has to cover a lot of these skills a lot of this is covered then right not every single thing will be covered but it's so much so much is covered that even if you look at the description because you were trained to understand this concept you were trained to know why people put descriptions this way and you you are trained to know that in market in this current industry how do we professionals who are experienced in this stuff how do we deal with this experience how do we deal with this type of wordings so you are then trained right this is why it's the last course in our platform that we are telling you to take it because we don't have any other option we don't have too much time for you so the first thing you should do if you're brand new and you have an interview lined up go to jobskillshare.org and log in after registration you're going to be automatically uh, you know um, redirected to this portal page which is basically kind of like where our members kind of go and find different things but for you you need to basically get straight to the get certification page and that's where you're going to see the full program then and this is where you need to click on start self-paced program that's kind of like designed for anyone who would like to become a modern IT professional who will be working on Windows 10 Azure AD Active Directory ticketing system so many different things are covered here but you will go straight to the last course of this uh, um, you know session um, this program which is IT support resume applying for jobs and communities so when you click on this course even though it says click to upgrade membership that's just for projects you can still click on this course it's free for people to take so when you get into this course and you will see a page of this course right now you're basically going to see a green button on the right side and it's going to let you start this course a lot of people come over here and they click on this and it, it's okay to click on this but the problem with this this is just a curriculum page so if you come to the interview preparation you can see you can't click on this so you do need to click on start the course and then you are inside this course so then start the course based on where you are because if you're applying for jobs if you're getting ready for jobs then you're actually looking into the introduction sample resume to use and if you are still applying and you're not in a scenario this scenario then I strongly strongly recommend to become the member then because then you're part of this area and here you're basically applying being ready kind of thing you're being told what to do for for this so then you're actually using this uh, this uh, area the first one sample resume what resume to download everything like that uh, and then searching but if you have already received a call right you're in a different situation now you have already done the resume part and you know you, you got you got that going right now all this uh, you know information and everything is is going for you everything is working for you so all you got to do is to prepare for the first call preparation for the on-site interview and then before interview recommended videos to watch is probably the 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 main thing of this one right you start with the active directory one basic help this hands-on task videos then you get to why i recommend network plus lab if you have uh, you know income you can definitely can then uh, actually go into more hands-on learning for uh, for premium members this is included then what you want to do basically to finish and that's why i say you're going to need some hours to do this you're going to actually start watching this playlist and this is probably one of the best playlists over here how many places can i apply uh, tell me about yourself is one of the best 
or you know the probably the most important question <laughs> that you need to really watch then help this interview question tell me about yourself again uh, is this a machine or on a domain or a work group work group versus domain explanation what is local and a domain user accounts all of these questions are tested from our, our communities that we know that people will ask these this type of questions if you're going to go for IT support positions and it doesn't end here right you're going to go a little bit more advanced now because some jobs are not just help that they're kind of like mix match so you want to then get another playlist and then finish off the, the 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 remaining ones over here now if you want to learn about the soft skills and this is a big area right here soft skills and tech skills together we, we kind of mock interview uh, the members and and 90 percent of the people that you will see on the camera over here have actually landed jobs right so if you want to join this community then you can click here and how to find top IT communities if you click on it you're going to see different type of community number one which is our discord community where you're going to see all the professionals like Kev Tech, Steven, uh, you know, uh, Kev Diaz these are actually professionals who are working Haifa um, there's so many people out there that is going to really help you and you're going to see them in these videos uh, so we are very thankful to them for uh, their you know help in these communities and that's not only it you can actually find more communities by just coming down and watching the other videos to find more and if you want to know about success story come on here click on it get some confidence a lot of times you just need that push you just probably need to relate yourself with somebody else and again lastly I am going to say that um, if you fail this interview because you're you just came in right and that's okay because in IT rejection is a part of this career and that's how we learn and that's fine because you're gonna learn more and you probably will find better opportunities so for for the other members and especially the members who are actually inside this community and I'm talking about this now again um, basically if you're in this situation um, a lot of time I see that uh, you know members um, they get a different concept of this whole program where they want to finish everything and then apply for jobs my recommendation as I mentioned this in other videos too, make sure you finish the first two courses probably third one too and then apply for jobs you will probably hear that in the courses as well sometimes those videos are uh, quickly passed through so we want to make sure we kind of force enforce that again that finish that step one course finish the step two course and then start applying for jobs because the rest of the courses over here is basically a career development courses and if you are not getting successful with jobs that's fine you should continue that you shouldn't stop and then apply and then continue the program that's okay and that's understandable because you may have a you know a, a market that may have a less amount of jobs available in this career so that's fine you should still then continue to learn the modern skills like md100 md101 uh, as your uh, sorry um, administ uh, uh, server administration that that's a part of that that whole career development it takes time for people to to really get things going so don't get overwhelmed this is why we have the discord community you should join it ask people what are they doing ask us maybe we'll give you um, some tips so good luck with people who are actually applying for the jobs i wish them all the best and people who are actually in this platform i wish all of you the best as well thank you